On the second day of Christmas, my true love said to me, I'm proud from Loris and Lee again. As different as two people can be, we're good as one, but we're better as we. Dee diddly dee 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 dee. We're Loris and Lee. Hi, we're Loris. And Lee. Or Loris. And Lee. And we're here with day two of our Vlogmas, Vlogmas. series. Vlogmas. Vlogmas. Don't we like Vlogmas. That's a word, apparently. It is. It's, well, all the kids are saying it. It's a smush up of two words Vlog and Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. I can't um, so lots of people are doing like the whole 24 days, but. Not us. We're no. going to give you a little sprinkling, a little smorgasbord. We're doing the middle-aged version. Yeah. Yeah. We'll just do a few until we get too tired and then we'll take a nap. Well, she will. I will. I'll, 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 be, I'll be looking after children. Yeah. Don't get to nap in, in December. Oh, no. So what are we going to talk about today, Liz? So I thought it would be really nice for us to share our um, Christmas traditions. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. Nice. Everyone's got yeah, those. Yeah, Christmas traditions. Um, yeah. So I see you're, you've come dressed for Christmas. Yeah, you? I've wrapped myself up like a present with the bow. Yeah. Do you like it? She's not sure. Um, comment below. <laughs> what are you thinking of this? It's lovely ensemble. Channeling Victorian riding gear at the moment. I'm really enjoying that. You know, kind of big uh, crinoline skirts, big lace up boots, this, all this, the puffy sleeve. It's bang on trend. It's straight out Is of it? Fashion Week. Is it? Yeah, Is and it? the little tied up hair look. So, and basically, I'm hoping to wake up and it's like I've been in a time machine and I'm in the Victorian era. That's very exciting. Yeah. So um, is this how you're going to dress for Christmas Day? Is this one of your traditions to dress up on Christmas Day? Uh, we do dress up on Christmas Day, yes. Um, I might not wear this. I'm not sure that my mum and my sister would be keen. Is that where you're spending Christmas? Uh, I don't think so this year. Oh. We spend every other year together. Where are you spending really nice. Christmas this year? Quite possibly in a luxury hotel slash spa. Thank goodness, I literally thought you were going to turn up at my house. <laughs> oh, that's true. No, that's plan B. Okay. Luxury yeah. hotel and spa yeah. with the dog. With the dog. With doggy. With sunny doggy. Aww. Yeah. So it'll just be me and her paddling in the pool, running through a wheat field and stuffing our faces. Is your husband not going? Well, he is, but I just don't feel he's part of the narrative. Fair enough. <laughs> it's fair enough. doesn't fit with my image of myself as single. <laughs> shouldn't say that. You'll cut that bit, won't you? No. Um, no. You're going to ask me about my Christmas So It's just all right. about you. Yeah. We've gone weird. What's your Christmas tradition? Uh, so we always go to my mum's. I've never actually hosted Christmas, which is a bit of a sad oh. fact. I know. Um, mostly because uh, we haven't had room in our house, um, but we've recently done a big refurb. And we did yeah. think that maybe this was the year that I was going to cook the turkey. Lai, husband, was going to cook the turkey. Um, mm. Mr. Lee was going to cook the turkey um, and do all of that stuff. But I asked my children where they wanted to spend Christmas and they wanted to go to my mum's, so, which is very cute. So, hi, mum. Hi, mum. Hi. If she's worked out how to use YouTube. Yeah, probably yeah. not. But, yeah. Um, so, yeah, we're going to spend Christmas there. She doesn't live very far away from us, so we'll um, have a tradition on Christmas eve of us all having matching pajamas which i have ordered oh. they're super amazing and if you um follow us on instagram i'm also um my real me tamazine kimba is on um instagram as well and i've got loads and loads of christmas pictures going up all season of our elf on the shelf and our disney stuff and you will see our christmas matching family pajamas from next thank you not a sponsor have paid for them with my own money um but we've got sequin ones they're oh, very cute yeah. um they arrived a couple of days ago so we'll wear those on christmas eve and the children will put out freshly made cookies that we bake on christmas eve for santa so and then we um do reindeer food which um doesn't have glitter in it because that's not oh, safe for good, good yeah, animals. But you can get this um, special kind of shiny stuff that is safe for birds yeah. and animals to eat. So we, like, I buy a special thing. I go to a pet store to buy it, basically. Okay. Um, and so we leave out reindeer food and a carrot, and then um, the children go to bed. I mean, they're you know they're nine and nearly thirteen, but yeah. you know they still well the, the nine year old. Now still believes so that's important and the 13 year old um just is quite happy to play along he likes the whole kind of like eating the cookies and that what stuff. kids are watching me no this is not made for kids <laughs> <laughs> okay we've got the whole filter we on we're not a, 
We're not. Yeah, we've ticked it already. We've ticked that yeah. every time yeah. on YouTube. Made no, for kids? No, the whole not channel made is not made for kids. We oh, don't make me. things for children. I'm not made for kids. No. I mean, we're family friendly. That doesn't mean our target audience is children. No. So, so maybe you won't, turn no, away we won't now. say any rude words. No. Um, and we won't do inappropriate content. But um, so if a child happened, I don't know, maybe this is inappropriate talking about Christmas. But anyway. Turn away now. Turn it? away now. Do not, we'll put a disclaimer. Don't let children watch this talk about I think Santa. it's so cute what you do. It's very family orientated. It is. It's really nice. Yeah, it's lovely. Well, it's, I go to the pub on Christmas Eve and then on Christmas Day we start drinking at breakfast. Oh, well, no, we don't. We have to drive. So yeah. we're responsible. That's why we go but to my mum's. But once you get there, stay. do you drink? Yeah, we stay at my mum's for two nights so that we can all oh. relax. Because um, no drinking and driving. No. At all. That's bad. It's very bad. But yeah, we always have um, champagne. Nice. For breakfast. I really wish we could, but driving. Yeah. yeah. Plus also, not. I'm a bit of a lightweight. You so, are, actually. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I remember when you had a bit of fizz. She's goes quite loopy. <laughs> but it's probably I, you know, I have to maybe have it later. Also, I fall asleep quite quickly. Yeah, yeah. Which is not good for Christmas Day. Yeah. So then we, the kids get up in the morning. They're not actually. They're not too bad. They like. They know seven thirty is. And actually, last year I had to make wake them up at half past eight, which I found was a bit of a bonus. Morning. I know. I was like, come on, children, wake up! I do that with my husband though. I'm like, do you like jumping in bed? Like, yeah, yeah, I do. I'm like, yeah, it's Christmas morning. Can we open the presents now? And he's just so not interested. He's like, oh, whatever. He's such a parent. Oh, uh, but yeah. And I'm like, I'm such a child. I'm like, yes, <laughs> the presents. Even though I know what they all are because we're at that you stage where we just, <laughs> I just, I bought them. We buy them. You know, we just buy them from the joint account. That's what it yeah. is to be middle aged, isn't it? Yes, no mystery. I just send my husband a list of like 12 things and I go like yeah. pick whatever you want so there's a summer element. But then they, they turn up at the house and I know from the packaging what he's bought. So mm. there is literally no mystery. But I love it. I love it. And yeah, the kids come down and we all put our dressing gowns on and we go into the sitting room and we open the stocking presents and they're really cute. And my husband and I do stockings for each other as well which is just like little so silly cute. things and like a bottle of beers and stuff like that yeah nice. well, I, might, I might like vlog that this year so you can all see my family oh my gosh that's what we should do what? we should you should vlog yours and i should vlog mine and then we should put it together as a loris and lee christmas okay cool yeah, yeah. Like, we can see like sunny open his stocking her stocking <laughs> she's so bad at that we can cut from like cute family christmas to couples christmas in a luxury spa yeah that'd be quite cute yeah we'll try we'll try we'll try we might do we'll, we'll see how cool. we'll see how it goes right. yeah, so that's well, I think all that's it Christmas. what about well no we haven't talked about what we eat well that's we should do that on another day thing. otherwise we're gonna no, 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 we've no, got no. like this 28 is, million days of traditions. christmas there's lots of things to do on oh, christmas it's uh yeah what do you eat turkey do you like turkey not really <laughs> <laughs> then why do you eat it well no i do normally have beef actually mm -hmm. Yeah. I love turkey, so I eat turkey. No vegan Christmas, yeah. No. My mum's vegetarian, though. Well, she's quasi-vegetarian. Like, she doesn't eat meat that's not been killed in an ethical way. So she'll eat game, because apparently shooting animals is nicer than anything else. Yeah. I mean, comment below on what you think about that. Oh, don't. Let's not get into it. Um, but, um, so she has, like, a duck breast or something, or pheasant or something like that, or partridge. Mm. Um, and we have turkey you have turkey we have turkey do you like turkey i love turkey and we have oh, we have all the trimmings we have sausages and bacon and cheesy leeks which oh cheesy leeks are nice mm. um, i've changed my mind i'm coming around yours yeah, and beans and we always okay here's a question for you internet world of the net do you have yorkshire puddings with your christmas dinner because i am team yorkshire puddings no i'm against i'm from yorkshire and I think you should only have it with beef. But Yorkshire puddings are so good. You should have it with beef. No, I have It's Yorkshire like having puddings. mint sauce when it's not lamb. You know, you've got sauce. you've got to keep these things together. It's well, like pony and trap. I always have Yorkshire puddings and I oh my god, bread sauce. So can I tell you my, my little secret about bread sauce? Okay, go on then. It's a bit of a guilty secret. So we always buy like the shop bought bread sauce because Is that the guilty secret? No, that's not even the guilty secret. Oh. I always buy two tubs of it. Two tubs? Two tubs. Two oh, two tubs. tubs. I thought you were two tubs and mix up, it no, together and pass it off as your up, own. We heat up one on Christmas Day and in the evening with the cold cuts, I finish off that. And then the next day for Boxing Day, 
I heat up the next tub and I have it warm at lunchtime with the cold cuts and then I finish it up in the evening. I love bread rolls. It's the only time of year you can get it and I adore it. And then I put another tub away for Easter because when we have like chicken at Easter. Mm. But bread sauce, like bread sauce. Like, I only mm. really feel like that about Magnum ice creams. Okay. What do you have for pudding? Are you um, a Christmas pudding fan or are you a chocolate pudding fan? I only like Christmas pudding because it has more alcohol in it, so I have that. I'm a, I'm a Christmas pudding fan. Yeah. Um, have okay. you ever burnt yourself though? I have. When I've like, set it on fire off. and then slightly burnt my lips. <laughs> mm, no, I, I think that's a really misunderstanding yeah. how it works. I, um, you, you weren't meant to drink the alcohol, <laughs> you set it on fire. <laughs> yeah, so um, those are our Christmas traditions, mm. food particularly. Um, mm -hmm. What are yours? Comment below. We'd love yeah. to hear yours and share yours. Yeah. And um, happy second day of Rockman. Yeah, and sorry if we spoiled it with the Santa thing. Sorry. Yeah. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.